This is a gentle cruise along the Yangtze River in the Free Gorges. But if the Free Gorges Dam at full capacity at 100% was flooded or collapsed, well, it's a different kettle of fish. If the Three Gorges Dam collapses or floods at 100% capacity, the flood will reach Yi Chong in half an hour. And in this show, what is happening with Delightful Pickle? I have actually done a cruise way back in 1994 from Wuhan all the way up to Chongqing, just at the very beginning of the construction of the Three Gorges. It was on holiday in cruise ships at the time, or river cruises. Nowadays, these ships are a lot bigger because of the Three Gorges Dam, etc. But this is what it's like, and I've just thrown a compilation of a small trip up and down the Yangtze River. It looks all wonderful and five star, and perhaps it is your cup of tea, but cruise ships nowadays are definitely not my cup of tea. If I did go on one, it would be on Silver Seas, but definitely not something like Royal Caribbean. A smaller ship would be ideal. And I think that's what they're trying to do with the Yangtze cruise ships, trying to make it or look like it's a five-star luxury holiday until you get to advertising like this. <laughs> Going back to the main title of the show, which is if the Free Gorges Dam at full capacity flooded or collapsed, what would happen downstream? This one we have shown in different versions before, but this is sort of more of the reality and what would happen to Wuhan in particular related to the virology lab. If the Gorges Dam collapses or floods at 100% capacity, the flood will reach Yichong in half an hour. The water in Yichong will flow at a speed of 65 kilometers per hour. For at least four hours, Yichong will be submerged under 20 meters of water. The loss of human life in Yichong alone will be 500,000. The peak of the flood will reach Wuhan within 10 hours and Nanjing within a day. It is still too early to predict how many casualties could be caused. Some opinions also noted that the world is calling for the investigation on the origin of the COVID-19 pandemic and many evidence points to Wuhan. An investigation of how this happened to the world. Out of common sense, and I think in Australia's national interest. However, if the Three Gorges Dam collapses or floods at full capacity, Wuhan, where the P4 laboratory locates, will be flooded and critical evidence could be destroyed. If the Three Gorges Dam collapses or floods at... The video you can see behind me, or what you can see now, is yesterday's pick uh, show, and you can see that on the link in the description below for today. She is doing incredibly well, and I think in January she's going to have her first set of injections. As always, many thanks to the people who do support financially, many pe thanks to the people who've gone over to the Pickle channel and just liked and subscribed. 
everything helps in every single way any money raised on this channel through super thanks or whatever uh, the memberships is going to the pickle foundation so she can have a healthy life and saving up for the injections the first lot of injections are quite expensive and also her spading for next year thank you now i may be wrong but it feels like every year in china between you could say april near enough to this time of year when the rains stop etc and winter sets in for a large part of the people's republic of china just a little pitter patter of rain seems to hit national headlines and every year we do get constant floods in china i know other countries do have floods um, in america in europe in australia for example this year but it seems to be more so or um, you could say put in the media more often and here's a collection which i gathered together um, over the years of 2021 and 2022 brings us to a close for today many thanks for your time and if you do have a little bit of extra time and you enjoyed the like the share the subscription would be most epic please if you have a little bit of extra time do check out the other channels as well or to check out my other youtube channels my name is james thank you so much for your time and i will say bye bye for now
If you got to the very end of the video, well done, many thanks, and why not check out some of these as well?